They say the internet is basically limitless in data, but did you know Google estimates that approximately the internet is five million terabytes of data, and one terabyte equals 1,000 gigabytes, which in that sense you can put the entire internet on 200 million Blu-ray discs. Psalms 147.5 says, Great is our God and mighty in power. His understanding has no limit. Like this verse says, God's understanding and his knowledge has no limit. So, in other words, you can't put his knowledge in, you can't put it on 200 million Blu-ray discs. Mark Twain said, Civilization is the limitless multiplication of unnecessary necessities. One of those unnecessary necessities to me would be the internet because you can put it on 200 million Blu-ray discs, but it's still limitless. If you're trying to figure out what you want to do with your life, all you have to do is ask God. Jeremiah 33 says, Call to me and I will answer you and tell you great and unsearchable things you do not know. You know I've been asking God a lot what he wants to do in my life for my future, since I'm a junior and all, and I'll be on my own in a couple of years. So imagine with me, you're searching for plans for your future on the internet, and Google isn't giving you what you want, and you get frustrated. Like the verse says, all you gotta do is ask God. Like my dad says, uh, if you're walking and you're breathing, God has a plan for your life. I want to be in the middle of God's will. What about you? We can go on the internet to find what we, what we want to do, but what I want to do is I want to ask God what He wants to do and have Him show me the direction that I'm going. We have to open our eyes to His guidance. A lot of times we have our eyes closed to what He wants to do because we're we're just so stubborn that we want to do things our way and not let God in. Romans 2.5 says, But because of our stubbornness in your unrepentant heart, you are storing up wrath against yourself for the day of God's wrath, when his righteous judgment will be revealed. The definition of being stubborn is hard to conceive, persuade, or move to action. So stubbornness is the problem. We go everywhere but to God for our problems. We go to the internet, we go to, the, we go to our friends, but God's limitless knowledge is right there. Have you ever seen the show Cops? They run up to someone's front door and they kick right through it. In life, that's, that's what we do sometimes, right? Instead of forcing, and, and we just force our way through it. And it's a lot harder to put a door back up than it is to kick it down. Sometimes I think we rely a little too much on the internet. So what we got to do is ask God what he wants us to do. Are you going to go to the internet or are you going to go to God?